Hey guys, how are you doing? So we've just been down to Ingram AV and had a session with Reed, the owner of the company, who brought out some really beautiful microphones for us to try out. All DPAs, all quite expensive. Uh, and on the way out, he said to us, listen, I've got a really interesting pair, quite a rare pair of mics. I'd love you to take them back to the studio to try them out, see what you think. So we thought that'd be a nice ending to the show. But why don't we take these pair of microphones, another pair of microphones that we normally use, and then maybe a cheaper pair of microphones and try and AB them all against each other to see what the results would be. So I have a pair of these uh, in my mic locker, which I've had for quite a while. Uh, they are a, a Lewitt LCT-040. They're a match pair, small diaphragm condensers, really inexpensive, but really good. Lewitt make great mics. These are around about 160 pounds for a pair, for a matched pair, which is a brilliant price. These are the microphones that we use on a daily basis. These are the DPA 2011As, which are 10 times the price of these, okay? We love them. These are the DPA 4041s. These are the kind of things that you would put up, you know, and record an orchestra with. These are very, very high-end, uh, very special microphones. But these are 8,000 pounds. So my question is this. If we record an acoustic guitar and we do all three microphones, are we going to hear that much of a difference that this would be 50 times cheaper than this? Are you going to hear that difference? Let us know in the comments. Cheers. See you next time.